Hi, thanks for joining me. Today I'm going to share with you how I made this adorable bookmarker with the new Sissix Scoreboard Treat Bag Topper Die. Hi, for today's project we're going to be using the um, Sissix Scoreboard. This is the new Treat Topper um, Bag Die that has come out. and um, I've already run this through my Big Shot. There are several pieces that come with this die. It's a really nice die. Um, the only thing I don't like about it, um, if I had to give it one fault, is I think that a lot of the pieces are just small. Um, this would be one of the um, toppers that go on top of the bag. And measuring it, it's four wide by about two high when it's folded. Um, that's when it's folded. Um, I like to use the top note die, uh, but this is still okay. It's pretty cute. I'm going to be using this piece today. Um, and this is like a handle type. Bag. Okay, so the first thing that I've done is I've taken a piece of cardstock paper and I've cut it um, at one wide by three inches long. And I'm going to put some adhesive on it and I'm going to attach it onto the front of my piece. This has rounded corners, so you could do one of two things. You can go ahead in here with your scissors and you can round it or you can if you have you know a rounder go ahead and take your your rounder and do it I'm gonna just do it by hand because I had some excess that I, when I moved it down it was hanging over so it'll look like that and um, you'll probably want to do the same thing on both sides and decorate it on both sides Okay, the next thing was you can either, if you have a laminating machine, I would recommend when you're done with your project going in and laminating it, it would make it stronger. Or if you don't, go ahead and cut yourself a piece of thin cardboard. This actually came from like a home grocery product. It was a box. So it's, it's kind of thick, but it's not too thick. Um, and I'm just going to go ahead... And with my hot glue gun or with some kind of adhesive, just anything you want to do, um, go ahead in. And I would adhere that down. And the only reason why I'm saying that is you just want something that's going to give you a little bit of strength um, on that. Let me put a piece of paper under here so I don't get any adhesive on my board. Um, but you're going to want something that's going to hold that for you and make it stronger. And just remember when you do this, you also want to turn this the way that um, it's going to fold. And just make sure that you line it up. And then that way it will give you something a little bit stronger um, when you go to fold it and put it on. Then I just simply took my hot glue gun and um, picked out some embellishments that I thought I'd like and ran a strip of glue. And then I'm going to take this ribbon that I have, this little tassel type ribbon, and I'm going to run a string of that along the bottom. My glue dried really quick there. Okay, once you have that all of that secure and where you want it, make sure it's dry too before you cut. I'm just going to cut off the excess. And then I had a little Prima type flower and I have um, a button so I'm just going to put these together and glue these together real quick. And 
And I would recommend on something like this, um, I know other times you've seen me, but I would definitely use some sort of glue gun or really strong adhesive because of the fact that it's going to be on the book. You don't want it to come off. Um, you want it to be pretty sturdy. So put our flower on there. And then the last thing you're going to want to do, of course, is to, um, after you're done decorating it and you have it the way that you want it, is you're going to want to put some magnets in here. And that way, when you go to close it, it's going to hold on to your book. Let me get my book out here so I can show you. So you find your page and you hook it on. And you could, depending what kind of embellishment you use, you could put it so that it will hang out. I hope you like this project and I hope you'll give it a try. Thanks for joining me today. Bye.